At the brink of defeat, we chose fire. The marauders fell to the flames, yet the fire raged out of control, burning all in its wake. The invasion was no more, yet the price too high. With defenses weakened, the Shadow Lord, Streptococcus, seeks the throne. Civil war spreads, while fate of the land rests on the shoulders of a wounded man. I'll be back. I seek the shaman. Then you must travel to the tallest peak of the farthest mountain. There you will pass through the mind's eye. But first, you must brave the forest of shadows. My horse grows weary of this idea. Thank you for your words. Onward. Yeah. Shaman, 
I've traveled a great distance and I bring you no offering. I apologize. I was attacked by a swarm of doctor ninjas. Did they cure you? No. I was expecting that they would be there and help me, but this was not the case. Ah, they are out of balance. They are trapped between their oath and the accountants. I have no need for coin. Thank you, Shaman, for your understanding. I seek your wisdom for this injury I've had for months now, and it heals not, and I have no answers. The cure must come from within. You must be balanced. I could try more greens, I guess. You must eat balanced. You must sleep balanced. You must be balanced. Is there possibly another faster cure? You can do a fecal transplant. What do you mean by fecal transplant? You follow the dog's example. How could I be like the dog? What does the dog provide? The dog provides poop. Poop? Poop. What, what about its poop? It is full of nutrients and biology and active germs that can combat what ails you. You want me to eat the poop of the dog? That's a cure? So I may either find a balance or eat fecal matter. Yes. Well, shaman, I thank you for your time and your wisdom. I, once again, wish I could repay you in another way. Your happiness is my payment. Feeling more balanced already. That's good news. Don't need to eat dog shit. Shake that cute little booty of yours. Let's get it. Ricky, how you doing, man? Bit of an odd proposition for you. Yeah, what's going on? Well, long story short, a couple years back, I took a ton of antibiotics for a staph infection I had, and my health hasn't been the same since. Dang, I took antibiotics when I was a kid one time. Straight shat my pants. Anyways, uh, have you tried out like kimchi or Yogurt, some probiotics, maybe? Yep, I've tried all that. Man, I'm, uh, I'm sorry to hear that. So, uh, what are you gonna do about it? I think a fecal transplant is the only way to go. And I think you would be a good fecal donor. I mean, I'm flattered, but, uh, you know that, that pants thing I mentioned a while back? Yeah, that was actually, uh, that was pretty recent. Hmm. Well, sounds like we're in the same boat. Yeah. Maybe we both could find the perfect fecal donor. Hmm. I think, I think I'm good. But you know, this does sound a lot like the premise of The Bachelor. The dating show. That's right. And it does.
Ah, bah, 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 bah. <coughs> Three, two. My horse knows of the horse of shadows. Then go there. <laughs> Get out of my face. <laughs> I'm collecting rocks. <laughs> Listen to me, Michael. You're gonna take over the family business and you're gonna learn all about the fecal transplants that we've been doing as a family, okay? And you're gonna understand something. Uh, my first transplant, it didn't go so well. <laughs> poop, poop, poop. With defense this weekend. The Shadow Lord strapped a cock is he seeks a throne. While fate of the land rests on the shoulders of a wounded man.